In the depths of unknown space, many years of light from distant stars to reach us, the revelation of the world is waiting. Picture the scene, a large, complex telescope moving silently through the cold vacuum of space, with sensors attached to the far ends. This is the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, a marvel of modern science, designed to penetrate the cosmic nebula and shed light on the deepest mysteries of the universe. As instruments begin to scan the dark past, a surprising discovery emerges from the shadows, a large and ancient planetary structure, home to rare and mysterious quasars, these quasars, relics of an early universe, shine with a brilliance that challenges our understanding of the universe's history. Not just the far reaches of the moon, but a remnant of the time less than 800 million years after the Big Bang, the time when the universe was in its youth. The discovery of these quasars, powered by supermassive black holes of unimaginable mass, will challenge everything we thought we knew about the early universe. How could these huge structures be built so soon after the birth of the world? What secrets are hidden in the moon that took billions of years to reach us? As JWST's artifacts delve deeper into this ancient universe, each revelation brings us closer to unraveling the mysteries of the universe's formative years. Lots of opportunities, lots of profits. This journey into the darkness of the universe is more than exploration, it is an attempt to understand the structure of the universe. With each passing moment, the James Webb Space Telescope moves closer to answering some of the most difficult questions in astrophysics and promises to reshape our understanding of the universe in ways no one else can. We can imagine. At the heart of this planetary drama is a discovery that could change our understanding of life's early years. Imagine three quasars, each a beacon in the dark, embedded in the ancient universe's structure. These quasars are not just distant lights, but remnants of the universe's formative years, shining since less than 800 million years after the Big Bang. The size of their supermassive black holes, some of which are 1.6 billion times that of the Sun, raises profound questions about how these supermassive structures were formed early in the universe's history. This is not just a scientific breakthrough. This is a glimpse into when the world is still being created. In the dark and distant regions of the universe, quasars shine with an unfathomable brightness. These celestial beacons are the powerful cores of ancient galaxies, powered by supermassive black holes surrounded by gas disks. The energy of the shield at play creates an environment of high energy that produces the brightness of quasars. For decades, astronomers have been fascinated by these bright objects, but their great distance and faint signals have made studying them difficult. Enter the James Webb Space Telescope, a technological marvel capable of capturing light from the far reaches of the universe with unprecedented sensitivity. JWST's advanced instruments have revealed an amazing discovery, a cosmic structure consisting of three quasars. Each quasar, which existed for the first 800 million years after the Big Bang, is a window into a period of the universe's history that was previously obscured by the limitations of previous observations. The three quasars, J0313-1806, J17-2115 and J1342-0928, are remarkable not only for their ages, but also for the large masses of supermassive black holes at their cores. J0313-1806 is a black hole with a mass of 1.6 billion times the mass of the Sun, J17 plus 2115 is a black hole with 1.5 billion times the mass of the Sun, and J1342 plus 0928, although smaller, is smaller. A black hole with 800 million times the mass of the Sun. From the Sun, this discovery promises to solve fundamental questions about the formation of such massive structures in the early universe. The James Webb Space Telescope contains many advanced instruments that have revolutionized our ability to explore the universe. Among the most powerful instruments are the Near Infrared Camera, NIRCAM, Near Infrared Spectrograph, NIRSpec, Mid Infrared Instrument, MIRI, and the Precision Guided Sensor slash Near Infrared Imager and Slitless Spectrograph. FGS slash Nyrus. Each of these objects will play an important role in the study of distant celestial bodies, including the newly discovered quasars. NIRCAM takes images in the near-infrared region, 
allowing researchers to observe faint, distant objects that other telescopes cannot see. This ability is important for studying the early universe, as light from primitive objects has expanded to longer wavelengths due to the expansion of space. NIR spec, on the other hand, breaks down light into its components and provides detailed information about the chemical composition and motion of celestial bodies. These spectral data are important for understanding the properties of quasars and their environments. With its ability to take images in the mid-infrared region, MIRI provides insight into the structure and composition of distant galaxies and their components. The high-resolution capabilities of MIRI allow researchers to trace the chemical composition of gas and dust within these ancient structures, revealing details that were previously inaccessible. Finally, the FGS NIRIS assists in determining the precise position and distance of objects in space, enhancing the accuracy of measurements and observations. The discovery of the Quasar Trio provides a unique opportunity to investigate the formation and evolution of supermassive black holes and their host galaxies. The immense masses of the black holes within these quasars challenge existing theories about how such structures could have formed so early in the universe's history. By studying these ancient quasars, scientists hope to gain insights into the processes that led to the growth of supermassive black holes and the development of their host galaxies. One of the main aspects of this research is to understand the role of quasars in the evolution of galaxies. Quasars release energy as sources of energy and fluxes that affect star formation in their galaxies. In some cases, these outflows can prevent or stop star formation, causing significant changes in the structure and evolution of the galaxy. By analyzing the energy emitted by the three quasars, the researchers sought to determine how these outflows affect their host galaxies and contribute to broader processes of cosmic evolution. One of the most remarkable periods in the history of the universe was the age of reionization, when the universe changed from opaque to luminous. At this time, more than 13 billion years ago, the universe was filled with an inert hydrogen gas that absorbed certain wavelengths of light, which the light could barely penetrate. As the universe grew, this gas became ionized, allowing light to travel freely through it, making the universe bright. The James Webb Space Telescope's observations of distant quasars are an important tool for studying this transition. By using quasars as a source of background light, scientists can analyze the gas between the observer and the quasar. Air absorbs light at specific wavelengths, producing absorption lines that indicate whether the air is neutral or ionized. The strength of these absorption lines provides important information about the rate of reionization and the processes that give rise to light in the universe. Quasars are not just light bodies. They are also strong promoters of global evolution. The enormous energy emitted by quasars affects their host galaxies. Sometimes, the flow of gas, dust and energy from quasars can stimulate or inhibit star formation in their galaxies. These flows can also distribute materials throughout the universe, influencing the formation of new galaxies and influencing the overall structure of the universe. The study of three quasars reveals how these powerful processes form their host galaxies and the universe at large. By examining the energy emitted by these quasars and its effects on their environment, scientists seek to understand the role of quasars in galactic evolution and the formation of cosmic structures. The James Webb Space Telescope has made a significant impact with its early observations. Notable discoveries include images of six galaxies that challenge our understanding of galaxy formation. These ancient galaxies, discovered a few hundred million years after the Big Bang, show remarkable levels of structure and organization. Their round hands and center bars suggest that the past was more complex and organized than previously thought. In addition to working with galaxies, Webb has also made advances in the study of planets. The telescope's analysis of the exoplanet WASP, 39b revealed a rich mixture of carbon monoxide, sulfur dioxide, potassium, sodium and water. About 700 light-years away, the planet is significantly hotter than Jupiter and is not considered a candidate for habitation. Online observations of the TRAPPIST-1 system have revealed a number of planets that are similar to Earth, although some, such as TRAPPIST-1G, 
are hostile to Earth as we know it. One of the primary goals of the James Webb Space Telescope is to identify and analyze Earth-like planets. By studying the light from these distant worlds, Webb aims to determine the composition of their atmospheres and assess their ability to support life. This search for Earth-like planets is an important part of astrobiology and our quest to find out if life exists outside our solar system. The Webb's ability to analyze planetary atmospheres in such detail represents a major advance in our search for habitable planets. As the telescope's observations continue, he promises to find planets that are very similar to Earth and could provide new insights into the conditions necessary for life. The data collected by the website is very useful in shaping our understanding of the world and our place in it. The James Webb Space Telescope is at the forefront of planetary exploration, providing new insights into the origin and evolution of the universe. His new discoveries, from ancient quasars to distant galaxies and exoplanets, are changing our understanding of the universe. As the website continues its mission, it is poised to reveal more secrets about the past and its potential for future discoveries. With each new discovery, the James Webb Space Telescope comes closer to answering some of the most profound questions of the universe. The telescope's advanced technology and innovative design promise to reveal mysteries that will shape our understanding of the universe for generations to come. As we look ahead to the future of space exploration, there is palpable excitement and anticipation for what lies ahead. Earth's journey has begun, and the James Webb Space Telescope is leading the way into the unknown. As he sheds light on the dark corners of the world and reveals deep mysteries, humanity stands on the brink of a new era of discovery. The mysteries of the universe await, and the James Webb Space Telescope is ready to unlock them, revealing a world more fascinating and complex than we ever imagined.